Hello, party people. It's springtime. We're at Target. I'm going to run inside and see all of the new stuff that they have. I'm pretty sure I'm going to pick up some Easter stuff for the kids' Easter baskets. I had a Valentine's Day fail, and I refuse for anything like that to happen for Easter. So I might go overboard for Easter. It's fine. No big deal. Let's see everything they have. Target dollar spot, seasonal section. Let's do it. Does it feel like spring where you are? Or are you still buried under snow getting that second winter? I hope you get some sunshine. Oh, by the way, I came to the nice Target. Looks like I came on the perfect day. Do you see these shelves? Oh my gosh, never have I ever seen more organized <gasps> shelves. I'm so excited. Okay, hold on, I'll get, let's do an overview first. Uh, bunnies. Um, oh my gosh. Little bullseye, what are you doing to me? Oh my God. Are you screaming? What is that? St. Patty's Day stuff? What? Oh my gosh, baskets and shelves. Is this the most beautiful Target you've ever seen in your entire life? I'm so stinking excited right now. I can't even contain it. Oh yeah, Easter stuff. Pillows, basket fillers. Hello, spring. I have a feeling that doesn't go there, but look how beautiful. Ooh, more pillows, those are nice. Okay, and then basket fillers over here. Oh my gosh, wait a second, what is this? Look how stinking adorable. $3 for a little, what is that? That's not an incense. It's like a, well, I don't really know. I love how they just dumped all their candles. Okay, so why don't we just start up here, get a little deep dive into what's happening. What are these, salt and pepper shakers? Nope, they're just cutesy little bunnies. They've got some gold bunnies without chocolate inside of them. These are $3. And then, oh, oh my gosh, why are some of them packaged? Oh, because it's a pack of two. Oh, cutesy little bunnies. They're super lightweight, but I feel like these are really trendy. Oh, and then they have the bigger golden bunnies, if you like. Comes on a little stand, it's $5. Some more bunny salt and pepper shakers. It's not really a salt and pepper shaker, it's just, oh my gosh, what is this? Ooh, a glass jar to hold all your strawberry candies for your grandchildren. Oh, some wooden bunnies. Look how cute they are. They're just waiting for you to take them home. These are $5 down here. So it looks like they're pretty similar, just different um, sizes up here. Moving on over here, you guys, I have no idea. You have no idea. I always see stuff on Instagram and I'm like, my Target doesn't have that. That's why I came here. I just had an inkling today. I was like, today's the day. I'm gonna find all the goodies. These wooden boards, I guess. They're $5. Those are darling. I don't know what you would do with them. <laughs> Put food on them, do whatever you want. Um, a little flower starter. You can get some daisies or carrots growing in your garden. Is this a shelf? They have it in two different colors. $5 for a wall decor shelf. All right, that's a little different. Is this edible grass? Have you ever tried edible grass? I haven't. Crinkle paper. Okay, for $1. I use tissue paper because then you don't have to clean it up. You know, it's like tinsel. That stuff gets everywhere. Oh, look, a little gar... $5. Oh, come on. It is wood. And you guys know the price of wood is going up like crazy. I actually really like the colorful strand. All right, and what... Do oh, these are the best. These are the ultimate. You wind them up. Well, we have to do it, right? Hey. Here we come. Looking for the deals at Target. Getting all the hot items in the dollar spot. I don't care who you are. If this doesn't bring you joy, uh, go see a doctor. Double bunny right there again. Oh my gosh, look, these are little felt carrots. They have, oh, onions. Green onions, I love this. Green onions and other onions. They have white carrots. Those are the fancy carrots. You only buy those carrots when you have guests coming over, you know what I mean? What do they have, turnips over here? Is this a beet or a turnip? I don't know, man. I need to brush up on my vegetables. I didn't know I'd be doing some trivia today. They have Easter bunny ears down there. Those are a dollar. And then these, yeah, see, I'm like, what am I gonna do with that? Am I gonna put food on this? I guess so. 
It's just a tray. You could literally put anything on it that you want. A candle, <gasps> Easter baskets. This is what I need. These are a dollar. They're plastic. Probably won't last forever, but that's okay. An assortment of colors, blue, green, pink. Oh, and then socks. I feel like this is a great addition to an Easter basket. And then they have some faux flowers. These are, ooh, actually they feel really nice. And they're $3. Yeah, they feel, they feel pretty cool. Should we browse over here? Look, they have, oh, they've got, oh, these are really nice bins. $5 for a wooden crate. They have the white and the brown. I'm sorry, I can't believe that's $5. It's crazy sauce. How much was that thing of garland? <laughs> $5, right? Okay. Oh, some cute little candles. I mean, they smell like you would think that they smell. Oh, not my favorite, but what? I, they're fun. They're, it's like, it smells like sugar. Light up glasses. I'm about to buy these. No joking. Three dollars. Some wooden signs. Some socks. These are cute. I don't know what you would. Is this how you catch a leprechaun? Is this a flower pot? It has a little drain spout at the bottom. That would actually be really cute for a little succulent or catch a leprechaun. I don't care. Pinch. Oh, that's really cute. How much are these? Three bucks. Or you can put your little succulent. In this, I love the look of a bicycle. Five bucks. Hold on, I don't think I showed you this little end cap over here. It is springtime supreme dream. I actually love these little, like a watering can, but for succulents. I broke all of mine that I bought. These are $5. Oh, $3, good. That's a good price. I broke all of mine because I put essential oils in them and it like eroded the plastic pipe or whatever, but. Oh, you can water your fake succulents with that. That's great. $5 for this Easter tree, a little Easter topiary with the Easter egg in there. That's really cute. Okay, then we have some towels up here. Some more towels up here. Plants are my soil mates. Ha ha ha. Happy house is the best house. Sure, sure it is. I, I moved out of someone's way so they could shop. So we'll start over here. Oh, $3 for these fake succulents that you never have to water and they always look good? What? This is a crazy good deal. Look at this one right here. Oh, hold on a minute. Look, it's a hanging one. Oh my gosh. I would pay $5 for one that was slightly bigger than that. That's really good. I feel like those are really nice quality for three bucks. And then they have these trays. What kind of trays are these? Oh, stacking trays, perfect blank canvas for your creativity. Well, I'm not creative, Target. I need you to like paint those for me, okay? Dog on duty, welcome sign. Got some grasshoppers up in here. You know what? Someone said that these look like something that they sell at, what's that store called? Let me think. I'm so embarrassed, guys. I just Googled high-end store, a strophe. <laughs> it's called Anthropology. Someone compared these two. That's how much uh, I don't shop high-end. So if you're into that, if you want to implement some of that, it's $3. They have, oh my gosh, a cute little bunny wreath. Do you see that? Adorbs. What's up here? Oh, that's from Spirit. Does not belong in the dollar spot but we'll take it five dollars i bet for that three for this is that a white erase board or what you cre oh i bet it's like if you're creative you buy this and then do something creative <laughs> with it three dollars this is oh it doesn't have a price <gasps> cheese board you get the double cheese this is like single serving cheese boards that's pretty funny five dollars for a couple of cheese boards these are actually fantastic what? That's so cool. What are these salad tongs? Cooking utensils, fantastic. A board swivel. So it looks like they're layered and you can just swivel yourself a board. Is this an Easter basket? $5 for this one. All right, you could do storage in that. Whatever you want. Here's another board. Lots of wood here, lots of boards. I guess boards are trendy, right? This is a slightly bigger, which is nice. $5 for this one. I've seen people talk about this and how absolutely trendy it is because of whatever fabric that is. I forgot what it's called. $5. This is a wall bookshelf. Do what you want with it. And then they also have this one where you can hang all kinds of stuff on it. $5. Like how much was that wooden bead garland again? That was five bucks, right? It's a much better deal. What does that say? Make more time for those little moments. 
Uh, this is a dish rack, so, or not a rack, a drying mat. I don't know, are you doing dishes and reminding yourself to make, I don't know, that doesn't make sense to me. So apparently this is for your laundry room, I guess. It's very kitschy and you can store all your uh, pods in here, $5. Oh, you can store rubber bands. You can store literally anything that you want in here. Okay, if you want that, $5 for, that's actually really heavy. Oh my gosh, and it's a, for pots and stuff. That's a great price for that Target, well done. And then we have some more flowers, assortment of flowers and foliage down here. This one's really pretty for spring. Love the purple hues. How about this one? Oh, now that is a sweet Easter wreath and it is $5. I thought it was three. The floral is $3. Look, a little washing board. You can wash one pair of underwear on here at a single time. $3 for that. And it comes in white. Oh, love this one. Look, it's way cuter. Laundry room open 24 hours. You wear it, you wash it. My laundry room is not open 24 hours, okay? There's definitely a closing time. Closing time. Time for me to not do laundry. Oh, you know what? This goes over here. And you know what else I saw? This one. They should call this the $5 spot. This is $5. I think that is so darling. A like, mini tapestry. <gasps> Grocery bag. Oh my gosh. I love fall most of all. No, it is springtime. Okay, where's the springtime one? I love spring most of all. They're just trying to get rid of that. Ooh, calligraphy. This would be great for an Easter basket. $3 for a calligraphy set. <gasps> These are fantastic too. Everything's fantastic, you guys. $3 for a glass spray bottle with a silicone ring around it. This is for soap or whatever you wanna put in it. $3 is a great price for a glass spray bottle like that. Some organizers here for a single dollar. Guys, you can't even get this at the Dollar Tree anymore for a dollar. It's a dollar 25, you know what I mean? Come on, down to Target. <gasps> What's this? Squeeze the day, the smallest little water bottle. It's a glass water bottle for $5. So if you're walking into yoga class, you need one. Okay, I feel like these are gonna sell really well too. I don't know how to decorate, but if you do, they have this plant stand. It is a single one. I'm trying to give you like the best view of it. It's five bucks. And then they also have it in white for $5. They have this storage tray. It is a Lazy Susan, hallelujah, $5 as well. Are those the same? Yes, they are. Moving on down to Funky Town. Here's a serving board. Um, I feel like if I accidentally scratch my nail on that, I would cry. And then they have a square one. These are really heavy. If you're into that, there you go. Two wooden bins, nesting storage bins. For five dollars i like how they are colored on the inside oh and some of them have rainbows on them oh a cute little house a novelty storage house that's five dollars oh my word what is this a rotating storage bin okay cool beans i like how there's dividers in here wine glasses some more succulents actually they have different looking succulents an assortment of them oh these bottles they keep coming back with these, so people must be loving them. I actually really enjoy the different colors, but then they also have the white ones as well. So if that's your thing. Oh, look at these shelves. There is so much stuff here. Look at these little shelves. And then they have the half moon over here, the crescent. That's not really a crescent shape, or maybe it is. I don't know. They have a couple of jars, um, different hues. So those are like, oh, I'll pick them up. They're like pinky hues. And then they have the green. I'm drawn to the green three dollars for two storage jars they have these those these look really nice too to decorate with bud vases three dollars for two of them wow that's a good price okay and then they have a spray bottle these are little spray bottles i love that they come in green as well um wait three pieces what are they out of their minds oh the stickers <laughs> so you can label them if you put some kind of essential oils in them or whatever you put in them. Is this a swivel tray? It is. Oh, how a darling. A little lazy Susan over here. Five dollars. You gotta work hard to make five dollars nowadays. And then what's this? Oh, this hangs on your wall. That's well, different. Okay. 
What is this canopy for? Oh, I thought that was a dog in there. I was like, a canopy dog bed? That is something special. $3 for, or nope, five, what? I don't know. $5, I should have known. $5 for that. And then they have some felt baskets for $5. They also have some cleaning supplies. <laughs> These are like the most ridiculous cleaning supplies I've ever seen in my life. But okay, actually this, oh gosh. Oh, I just hurt my hand. This scrubber looks really cool, $3. I love the handle on that. I have one like this at home. I use it pretty often, I guess, three bucks. <gasps> a lint scraper. Okay, now this is a cool cleaning tool. Three bucks for this one. It's just like this one, I don't know, just got me and I'm like, really? Okay. Uh, this makes me wanna get a cart before everyone comes and buys them. This, is, this would be great to fill up the Easter baskets with. Nice and uh, vibrant. Then they have some frames. When I say some, I mean one for three bucks. Okay, back to this spot now that the person has done shopping. Okay, it looks like these are placemats and they have a bunny on them. How adorable. Okay, so what else is down here? We have, again, oh gosh, I just broke it. Well, it's, it's cheap, what do you expect? I bet it's $5, but like, are you kidding? These little bins for a dollar. It's like make your own macrame hanging planter kit. All right, I'm gonna pass on that. But if you want it, it's here. I'll save it for you. How about that? These planters are $3. This is the best. Thank you, Target. I need some planters. Look at this little bird's nest. This would be adorable. Oh my gosh, I love the round one. Okay, how much is this crap? $5 to feed the birds. Oh, I didn't show you these. Plants are my soil mates. Haha, -ha, we already got that joke. Give yourself time to grow. Okay, that's good advice. Feed the birds. Wait, what, <laughs> what movie is that from? Toppins a bag. Toppins, Toppin. Mary Poppins, anyone? Come on. All right, we've got some carrots over here. What's this, lavender? Everyone's like ripping into these. Jeez, rude. I really like the daisy one. $3 and you get a little bucket and some soil and seeds to grow your own things sunflowers that's really sweet more lavender okay more plants oh my gosh absolutely hilarious <laughs> i wet my plants plants are my soil mates what's the white one say back here oh nothing oh and this one's just a dollar okay cool beans proud plant parent that's some good stuff right there and they have a watering. This is not gonna water much, I'll tell you that. I need a really, really big one because I don't like to refill mine. Walk inside, back outside. $5 for this rainbow one. I guess it's pretty, but is it practical? I don't know. Ooh, this one is fun. Look at the honeybee, the hive, and the little flowers on there. Yeah, definitely not practical for me because I have too many plants and I don't even have that many plants, but it is fun. Some chalkboards over here, rectangular ones, ones that look like a house, a pentagon, reserved for the dog. They have something where you can hang the dog's leash. They have this bin down here. Oh my gosh, they have a mug. I love you. And then it's a cat bowl. I meow you. Really? They couldn't come up with anything better than that? What does this one say? Well, I don't speak Spanish. There's that. I woof you. I know how to say that. The other side of I woof you is I love you. Well, cool. Food storage container for your teeny tiny dogs or to hold the treats. Perfect. A couple baskets over here. These are rope baskets. They're $5. I think those would be great for Easter baskets as well. Look at this drying rack. Hold on, it comes in black, it comes in white. Oh, that's pretty funny. <laughs> Again, not practical for me. We have too many towels, but that's pretty sweet if you need something small. And then they have some laundry signs, single and clean, looking for the perfect partner. Pretty funny. Laundry, family operated. Oh, that's hilarious. Family operated, open 24 hours, wash, dry, fold, repeat, help always wanted. Wow, that, I like that sign. That's really accurate. I've never read anything like that. They have this one, wash, dry, fold, repeat. And those are the two that I see. They also have this tray. Looks really nice. What else do they have for us? They have all these storage containers. Um, I think they had these for last season. So they just have an assortment of sizes. And then it comes with this like wooden lid. 
I don't think it's very secure. $5 for those. They have bitter, bigger square ones, smaller square ones, and then some round ones. Someone left their drink. I wonder if it's still warm. No, it's empty. Rude. They didn't leave any for me. Okay, a shelf. Ooh, it looks like, ooh, it's a tiered tray. Thought it was a shelf. It's, well, I guess it could be a shelf if you wanted it to be one. $5, I feel you can put your essential oils on that. I'm talking a lot about essential oils That's for someone who like barely <laughs> uses essential oils. $5 for this basket. You could use that as a garbage can. Let all your garbage fall out of the, all the holes on the sides. Here is some nesting wooden crates. So three of them for $5. Oh, this is sweet. What could we hang in here? Oh, it has coloring books and stuff. I was thinking of dryer balls. Well, there's, there's my mom brain working. A wire bin. <laughs> what can you store in a wire bin? A blanket maybe, I guess. Maybe some towels. Toilet paper. Maybe possibilities are endless. Um, so for your coloring books, they also have an option for a, a bus. Cool. I did not expect to be in the do dollar spot for this long. Look what they have. I feel like this is great for an Easter basket for one, you know, an older child. $5 for this little electric uh, face brush. Maybe I'll buy it for me. I'm just saying, you know, treat yourself. Heat pocket. They have reusable straws, silicone straws. Oh, peeps. Wait, what is that? A chick-shaped bath bomb. Huh, well, don't drink the water, okay? Oh, they have even more bath bombs up here. It's pretty fun. A rainbow bath bomb, but it's really just two clouds. So that's false advertising, I feel like. Okay, what's this? Oh, two little baby clips for a dollar? Target, what are you doing? Bobby pins? Those are actually cute for a dollar. Okay, worth it. A pet waste bag dispenser. Well, now that's fun. $3, always pick up the waste. I love that they do this. Typically it's closer to summertime where they put out all the sunglasses. Oh, $3. I feel like in the past they were a dollar, but these are nice quality, especially if you're someone who like loses sunglasses a lot or whatever. Charging cables. I didn't smell any of those candles. I'm not a huge fan of the candles at the Target dollar spot. So I'll, I'll smell them in a little bit. Here is a candle craft kit, nine pieces for $3. That's fun to like get your kids busy or yourself busy for, I don't know, 30 minutes. It'd take me probably three hours to do that, but if you're crafty, a wreath kit. Okay, so we're entering the crafting section. They, ooh, a dry brush. Do you guys do this? I tried to do it for a while. Yeah, I don't know, it didn't work for me. Two in one foot brush. Ooh, I need that. Yeah, dude, it's almost summertime, you know? Gotta get my summertime heels looking fine. Summertime fine. Oh my word, a nightstand cup. So it's a little cup, but it covers it. So you don't tip it over. I guess if you tip it over, it would still fall everywhere and get everything wet. I don't know. It's a good idea and it is cute. Look at these dish towels I found. Age isn't important unless you're wine or cheese. I didn't read this one. Hummus, mustard, pepper, jelly, meats. Okay, so everything that's on a charcuterie board, cool. Some more dish towels. Um, what does this say? Fancy choice, chocolate. Does it say chocolate? I feel like that says chocolate. Wash your hands, always good advice. <laughs> Are we still having people tell us to wash our hands? I actually, oh my gosh, love this one. Okay, found it. Found the ones that I love. You're the one that I want. You are the one I want. I love how it has yellow on the back, floral on the front. Measure life with smiles. Ooh, I love that advice. That's exactly how I do it. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? A bon appetit, you creeps. Love that towel. What does this one say? Love grows best in little houses like this. Oh my gosh, I feel like this is left over from Valentine's Day maybe. Um, that's really cute. That's, it could be an all year kind of thing, I don't care. Okay, and then they have some more down here with the oven mitt. They have some mugs, bestie mugs. Waterless oil aroma diffuser. Very interesting, don't know anything about that. Two-tone scarf for five bucks. That's pretty, this could be, you could hang this over a couch. A punch needle kit. I had one of these when I was a kid. I'm not sure I ever finished it. <laughs> I had good intentions. It just takes forever, you know what I mean? Um, okay, and then uh, that. 
coming into all the things that you can put shove in your kids' Easter baskets, I'm sorry, or your, your own belly, sour punch twist, I'm down for that. Some sunglasses, an assortment. Oh, I like this tortoise shell sunglasses. Okay, so how much are these? Okay, so these are a dollar. The kids' size are a dollar. They have a three pack of cotton candy. I feel like that's great. Don't know how much that is, but I would imagine probably three bucks or so. It's cotton candy, I don't know. Some chalk, they have these wooden eggs that are quite popular. $3 and they have the colored ones as well. They have some window clings, some window stickies. What's in here? Building blocks, interesting. Ooh, peeps, what's in, I don't, don't like peeps. Do you like peeps? I feel like there's two kinds of people in the world. This has glitter dough, glitter dough, okay. Some bubbles, some torpedoes, a yoga mat, a baseball. Oh my gosh, did you see this? And I didn't <laughs> at first. This is the most adorable thing I've ever seen in my dang life, okay? I don't, not that we need pillows, they just end up on the floor. Welcome to the Carrot Patch, organic and 100% homegrown. They, oh, I really like this one. Look how sweet it is with a little puff on the, on the side. And then the back print is darling. Wipe your paws, sit, stay. I don't know, it's very demanding. Reserved for the cat, that's pretty funny. Um, okay, and then what are these? Toothbrush holders or something? $3, I quite like that. Um, and then they have clearance over here. So behind us, I'll just give you a once over, okay? I'm not gonna go digging into all of this unless I see something worth our attention. This is just stuff you shove in your kids' Easter baskets and they say, oh my gosh, look how cool, and they play with it for 20 minutes and then they forget that it exists. Actually, this one's really fun. A bucket of fun, moldable soap and storage bin. I quite like that. Ooh, bath Play-Doh, perfect place to play with Play-Doh is all I'm saying. They've got Band-Aids. <gasps> a Skip It? They have a Skip It here at the Target Dollar Spot for just three dang dollars. About to buy this for myself. You guys, this is a workout. I'm saying cardio all the way. All right, anything else that you see? All the candles. They actually, like some of these holders are really pretty. The scents, I feel like we're all just blending together. This one's really pretty. Cottage Clover, like it's okay. Like they're just so mild, you know what I mean? If you just like the ambiance of a candle, perfect. But if you wanna stank your place up, this is not the place to come. Like Clover Fields, I don't smell anything. I think I glazed over this one. You can make your own succulents out of some clay. How funny is that? I just spent way too long filming a reel for Instagram, all the new stuff at the Target Dollar Spot. Obviously, you guys got a much deeper dive into it. Uh, so this stuff looks to be new up here. They did have organizing stuff up here for a little bit anyway. Oh my gosh, love these blue flowers. This whole, just this right here. Can my house look like this? How do I make that happen? <laughs> I guess I could buy it all. $10 for this. They have some throw rugs, some pillows. Those are not rugs, they are blankets. Oh my gosh, then they have the pink and purple hues over here. This is darling, why do I love this? And then, of course, matching candles, because how can you live your life without everything matching? Simply Modern, oh my gosh. Yes, these are expensive, but they're on sale, $1.50 off. They actually, this brand has a ton of different prints for kids. They've got Disney, They literally all kinds. Check out their website. They sell a lot of them on Target, but their website has way more. They have some journals up here. What is this spring stuff? I don't know. <gasps> Yellow and green. I think these are my favorite colors. I'm not really sure because I don't have favorites, but I love that. I have yet to take a thumbnail, so, oh my, oh my gosh. Do you see what, do you see what I, it's not Christmas, but I'm gonna sing that song every day for the rest of my life. What on earth is this? Oh, of course it's Hearth and Hand with Magnolia, a rainbow stacker. Look how adorable. Yeah, these are the good candles. Yeah, I get excited about candles, but not the ones in the Target dollar spot. Ooh, that smells good. Ooh, that smells good too. Actually, it doesn't really smell that good. Ooh, that way, I quite like that one. Fresh linen, I gotta smell another one. 
Mmm, I love that. I actually really love that. Rhubarb sugar cane. I'll pass on that one. Okay, anyway, candles, you guys get it. That's fine, but pillows. That's what we came for. I don't, those bunnies look kind of sad. <laughs> Not going to lie. Do they need to eat the happy Easter pillow? You guys, I don't do pillows in my house. I just, maybe it would elevate my house, but I'm not at that level yet. Stoneware egg filler. We've got another wooden bunny. We have even more pillows. Oh, look at that springtime pillow. That's springtime fun. Whoa, look at that plant. Guess that price. I bet you it's well over a hundo. Jeez, 150. I don't like playing guess that price at Target, okay? Okay, quite like these. $10 for that cute little bunny blanket. And then they have some more blankets and pillows. Oh yeah, I like these. You know who has a ton of pillows? Um, home goods, oh my gosh. An obscene amount of pillows. If pillows are your thing, you go, what are you doing at Target is all I'm saying. Look how pretty, someone was about to decorate their house. Why did they decide against this? This is great. Someone's mom was like, you put that down. We gotta go. <laughs> um, okay, love these little fake succulents. They're darling, right? Those little teacup ones. And I actually really like the look of this planter. All right, let's see. Oh my gosh, I almost dropped it. I did drop it, $20. Oh, it hurts my heart, but it is it is really pretty. Dan and Shay, man, you're gonna get me demonetized. About you always will. I stink and love Dan plus Shay. All right, some vases over here. I don't know, I kind of don't want to guess that. Man, this is heavy. $30. <laughs> I guess $30 is whatever. Like, it's really heavy. $15 for that one. Not bad, not bad. A stone lamp. Those are coming back. I hope you. I'm trying to drag this cart around. I have like nothing in it. Oh, I was like, oh, I'll come back to the Target dollar spot, you know? Give myself a break. Um, do you see any cool spring stuff over here? Is this where I should take my thumbnail? I always worry about that. It's so important, but it's like, really? Come on, just click on the video and see what Target has. <laughs> so if you clicked on this video, which um, you have, uh, thanks, thanks for clicking on my video. <laughs> Look at these, this little geometric succulent plant holder. Little mother-in-law tongue over there. Ooh. Look at their furniture, Target. Oh my word, love this. Hold on, does it open? It does, I bet you this is an arm and a stinking leg, it's a trunk. 80 bucks, my lord. Oh, I just can't, I just, it hurts my heart. That's really pretty too. Some wreaths over here, cool. Oh, more pillows, cool, cool. Right it's tonight. Oh my girl's at the party, look at that body. She cannot think of nothing but that. Cause I'm gonna have to ride it tonight. How do I cross my legs? How do I act like a lady? Okay, hearth and hand. I might just take my thumbnail here again. Um, but I don't know, redundancy. I did it during the holidays, maybe? Uh, some new things. I really like this vase, this vase. $15, pleasantly surprised. Congratulations. Okay, they have some gardening things over here. Oh wow, for the supreme gardener or someone who just likes to pretend they're a gardener, they have a nice kneeling pad. This is really nice. Let's compare $13 compared to the $3 at the Target dollar spot. These stone vases, I told you guys they're trendy. Joanna Gaines gets her uh, home decor tips from me. I mean, who did you think? I give her all my good tips. All right, let's explore the hearth and hand section. Oh, look at that canvas bag. That artwork is really pretty. They have a lot of storage bags and baskets. Okay, this decor tray, 35 bucks. That's really pretty. This one was nice too. Here. What do they have? Some trays. Okay, I'm just so confused in this area. They have black plates. Those are rustic. All right, they've got some, a lot of wooden stuff. Oh, biscuit cutters. All right, well that I understand. It's like kitchen stuff. What do you put in these? Eggs? I don't know. All right, moving over here. I don't really know what to do in here. Four in a row. 
That's a fun game. How much for this crap? 15 bucks. Okay. <laughs> oh, they have Jenga. But she calls it the stacking tower. What a rip. They also have a tree house. That's pretty cute. Um, they have this thing. They have this. <laughs> I don't know. It all looks the same to me. Every season I'm like, wait, was there a new release? Okay. Some more kitchenware over here. These baskets. Yeah, these must be high and trending. Baskets over here. Baskets galore. Use a basket to store your life. Glad you're here. Do you see that entry mat? Ooh, that stoneware looks real good. Oh my gosh, I didn't see these plant trellis stakes. Oh, that's exciting. A propagation vase? That's the most beautiful propagation vase I've ever seen. They have some candles over here. Ooh, to elevate your cheese board, you guys. This is it. I actually hate the texture of whatever this cheese board is. This is $25. One time the Target dollar spot had a set of cheese board knives or cutters, whatever they're called, uh, for three bucks and I got it. And they look so fancy. Joanna Gaines sell whisks. Real quick, I found Yankee Candle here. Poppy Fields, actually this one smells really good. Mountain Glow. Yankee Candle doesn't sell anything for 10 bucks, but Target was like, oh, come on. Can you cut us a deal? And they're like, yeah, we can make smaller ones, I guess. <laughs> okay, quickly covering some of the other things in the store before we head back to the seasonal section. Oh my word, I'm crying over these plates. These are adorable. They're $3 a piece, is that a joke? Oh look, they have a little bunny plate. And for his tail, you can put the dip in there. Dip it good. They, I really like these little flower plates. Oh, it's a candy bowl? Yeah, right, that's a cereal bowl for me. Actually, I need more. That's a dessert bowl, maybe? This vase is cute. Dash always does this seasonally. They have $13 and it's a waffle maker. You can make waffle sticks with that one, cool. I love that Target always has arts and crafts for the kiddos for each season. So this is the spring stuff. They also have a massive container of chalk for six bucks. Wait, even more arts and crafts over here. Oh, these are so fun, painting. Oh, and then they have some baskets. Ooh, I didn't see these, those are cute. They have a few more buckets over here. These are quite large and they're $3. Always have some new stuff out for the bathroom section as well. These are darling. Um, what caught my eye, they have different mats, um, like bath mats. This one's really cute with the flowers. I like the colors. We've made it, oh my gosh, we've made it to the Reese's Haven. Look at all these Reese's. You know what sucks? If you're allergic to dairy, that sucks. What is this? A golden egg? It's empty. Oh, that's fun. Six dollars. I'm, I'm taking that home with me. What am I going to do with it? I don't know. Leave me alone. Eight dollars for that one. It's got some prints on it. Ooh, hold on. How much is this? Oh, oh, oh my gosh. Ten dollars. I don't know. I feel like we could do something fun with this one. What is an Easter basket without egg-shaped bubble gum? Nothing. Okay, I know people go crazy over these Cadbury mini eggs. Not me, man, not me. I feel like it's a, a crusty M&M. <laughs> oh no, wait, look, a golden egg up here too. Is this empty as well? $4, okay. All kinds of golden eggs. Wait, Pringles for $11.59, rip. Kinder Joy, you can get a whole lot of those, you guys. The peep selection is out of this world. Why? They've got birthday cake peep, they have cotton candy, they have wild berry, they have all kinds of flavors. I'm gonna pass on every single dang one of them. Except for this one, what is this, covered in chocolate? All right, I'll give you a try. I like marshmallows, I like sugar, but I don't love peeps and I don't know why. Okay, here is some Easter stuff. I see a cross, otherwise spring, hello spring. They have some nesting eggs. This hello spring sign, $15. Um, oh, look at this guy. He has his Easter basket. Oh, it broke. Here is a rainbow. Let's get excited. They have some felt wreaths and a felt garland. What else is here? Oh, some paper products. They always have, they always do a really good job with that. $10 for this egg hunt. What is this, a clock or something? Or just a decor piece? Okay, I can dig it. 
five dollars for these carrots those are sweet look at this bunny for 15 the tiered tray 15 for that oh look at this bunny i like how she's holding flowers i suddenly got real hungry like for a hot dog like mustard something with vinegar all right stuffed animals <laughs> And then they have baking stuff over here, a lemon sandwich. You know what they had? This. These are gluten-free and I can't really read the rest of the box. Like I can bear, how? They should do like dark letter. I don't know, I can't read that. Ooh, a Cradberry cream egg. <laughs> Limited edition, eight cookies. Oh, that's delicious. Anyway, these are gluten-free. <laughs> Strawberry shortcake cookies. Um, ooh, a hippity hop. Yes, Oreo, always coming with the new things. Fun, five fun Easter designs. Well, that's exciting. If that doesn't excite you, I don't know what will. Baby bunt cakes, Twinkies with pink? Does anyone actually like Twinkies? I don't know, man. I like cake, but I don't like Twinkie. Peeps, a pancake. I mean, I'd eat one if someone offered me one. I'd be like, heck yeah, thank you so much. <laughs> Some spring sprinkles. Cute. Okay, this is the baking section. Here's the edible grass. Two dollars. Oh, I guess, oh, people use it for like cakes and stuff. I thought you put it in Easter baskets. Ah, oh, little did I know. Filled marshmallows. Wait, what are they filled with? Chocolate, that's what they're filled with. Jet puffed bunny marshmallows. Yeah, I'm gonna grab some of those. Those are gluten-free. <laughs> Spring Chick Cupcake Kit. Okay, I feel like you always get some good ideas here that you can pretty much do yourself. Tie-dye Easter egg kits. I like the Pyrex containers that they always have. This one's pretty large. I love the prints, $7. And then if you're doing like cookie decorating or something, put this down on your table for five bucks. Blossom Cookie Kit. Oh, Lucky Charms. I saw that, I feel like on Instagram somewhere. So that's really cute for, what is that? Um, not Marshall's. <laughs> what is that day? The 17th of March. March. I don't know. I uh, tried to get there. Oh my gosh, the carrot whisk, you guys. They have it. It's back. It's back again. I have like four of them <laughs> now. Thank you so much. Um, they have some Easter or springtime cookie cutters. Ooh, a bunny bait. I don't know if this will bring in the bunnies, but it'll bring all the boys to your yard. A spring clover? What's in there? Bunny kisses. Ooh, oh, hold on. I had these spring shimmer almonds. I had the candy coated almonds. You guys, I nearly chipped a tooth. The Jordan almonds? How do people do it? Are you kidding? Is this a joke? I love all the Easter decorating kits. Or I should say the Easter egg decorating kits. Oh, are these filled eggs? Wouldn't that be nice? No, they're not filled. Oh, these might be though. Nesting, Easter, it's not. <laughs> $5 for those. <gasps> Bunny ears, the big ears. We always got one of those in our Easter basket as kids. You see that chicken and waffles down there? I could go for some chicken and waffles right about now. Right about now. The funk show will check it out now. What are these bugs and butterflies? Butterflies and bugs. Nothing makes them happier than a giant pair of juggles is an acrobat. Anyone? Remember that movie? Anyone, please. You have to tell me. Oh gosh, I don't even know what it's called. Hot chick. Hey. Oh, look at these. Egg cups. You can use that anytime you want. Boiled eggs. Hard boiled eggs. Soft boiled eggs. Be colorful. Be radiant. Be bold. Do we need our Easter bunny, our chocolate Easter bunnies to give us words of encouragement? I guess, why not? Oh, a reister bunny. Oh man, I'm drooling. I am drooling. We have a shark basket. We've got a dino basket. We have a unicorn basket and a turdy. I know I showed you the dinosaur, but there was a turdy. <laughs> when I say turdy, I mean turtle. Oh, these are sweet. The rainbow baskets. I want something that, oh my heavens. How darling is that, man? I do want something that will grow with my kids because I. I'm not the type of person to buy a new Easter basket every year. I'm not even sure Meredith has one. <laughs> so like something like this, neutral and plain, I feel like is perfect. The white ones, these are actually perfect. $5. I might just get these. They, kind, they nest inside of each. Yeah. Okay. I'm doing it for each child. Done. Okay. And then they have grass and 
what? I don't know, buckets and I have no words left in my brain to share with you. Eggs. I thought they had, okay, here, toy filled eggs. I was gonna say, I thought they had these. Yeah, they definitely do. So you can buy them already filled or, ha ha, ha ha. You can, <laughs> you can just get this stupid little set. Oh, I'm getting a phone call. Okay, well, turns out our Easter eggs are old and crusty and broken. We've had them for uh, literally 12 years. Uh, so, you know, after a certain amount of time. So we are stocking up, my friends. I think I have around 450 eggs. They're $3 for 48. I feel like that's a great deal. Are these good quality? I don't know, but again, the ones that we had we bought 12 years ago, they're not they weren't like the supreme dream, <laughs> you know? And they lasted several years. Oh, these are jumbo. Yeah, we have all sizes. Ah, uh, well. All right, well, that's fine. Oh, now I'm thinking because we are having so many people come over for the Easter egg hunt, should I get more than one golden egg to make it fair for the kids? Or should I just be like one winner, you know, not everyone's a winner type of thing? Or is everyone a winner on Easter? You know what I mean? Like, I don't want to leave people out. I'm gonna have to think on that. Okay, I'm sidetracked in the Easter candy section. Are you, what, what is this? New flavors of candy? I'm so far removed because I haven't been buying this stuff for the kids much. Vanilla frosting. Someone tell me that's gross so I don't have to sit here and dream about it. You know what else I saw? Lemon crisp Kit Kat. I might just, curiosity. I freaking love lemon. I don't really love Kit Kats. Fruity Pebbles cereal candy eggs. What is the world coming? <gasps> oh gosh, it scared that crap out of me. So, someone was calling for their family member. Ooh, okay, I'm okay. You're okay. What are they saying? Cereal. Oh, and then they have the chocolate fruity pebbles. Man, I don't know what the world is coming to, but I kind of like this aisle right here. Easter favorites already in the egg. $6.50 for those. I'm trying to find candies. Okay, here. I bought a large bag from, where was I? I was probably Costco, I guess. So I think I should probably get more, but I'm try to find non-chocolate eggs if you're, cause we like to set the eggs out the night before cause there's so many. And um, you know, when Florida, the sun shines like 90 degrees as soon as the sun comes out at eight o'clock. Did I just break that basket? By the way, these baskets are not that great quality, but we'll see if we can make them last for the rest of their lives. <laughs> this is the kind of person I am. Yes, Reese's eggs. I'm buying, I'm trying to limit myself to, um, otherwise, if I buy a whole bag of them, I'll eat the whole bag and then that's just trouble. This is the spring section. Ooh, grills. Don't even wanna know how much those cost at Target. Ooh, I like this bench actually, this like long bench here. Mix and match your own set. They have some really nice furniture at Target. Everything just looks so chic. And then once it's in my house, I'm like, it doesn't look so chic anymore, you know? I really like those pillows. Those are really pretty. Oh, they sell seeds here for an arm and a leg. Go to the Dollar Tree. Oh my word, look at this gazebo. That is darling. Backyard, oh, it's a bungalow. How dare I? $450. You can keep it, Target. All right, what else do I need here? Okay, hold up, because I did see something pretty cool the other day. Oh, yeah, 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 here it is, here it is. Look, a pizza garden, so you can grow, mm, what do you grow, mamma mia? It's oregano, cherry tomatoes, basil, is that it? But isn't that cool? It's $13, and I just thought that was so fun. And then they have this rainbow garden, so carrots, eggplants, uh, what else is in here? Sugar snap peas. Is that it? I feel like it would have more. I don't know, but anyway, look for these kits. I feel like that's really sweet. I want to do a salsa garden. Oh, a terrarium, microgreens, mint. Ooh, wow, a mint. This is <gasps> lavender. It's good, for all good things for my herb garden in the future. Anyway, I want to do a salsa garden. So like onions, jalapenos, tomatoes, cilantro, things that you need to make salsa. Mmm, too bad I can't keep anything alive. You know what I mean? This one looks different. 
I don't quite like that. Okay, that is it. Thank you guys so much for watching and shopping with me. I hope you enjoyed seeing everything new that they had at Target. I wanted to stay longer. Not that they had any more like spring stuff. Uh, I always like grocery shopping at this Target because it's the nicest, but Wentworth has a dentist appointment real soon. So I need to get home and bring him to that. But anyway, thank you for, oh no, no, woo, wait, hold on. I know what you waited around for. You want to see if these are any good? Because I sure do. A little lemon crisp. That's good. Yeah, I'd eat it. I'd eat a second one. <laughs> Don't forget to hydrate because it purifies your soul. Thanks again for hanging out and shopping. I'll see you next time. If you want to subscribe, put a little happy in your day. Bye.